Hello and welcome learners. Wish you all are doing well. We all have our limitations. Within that limitation, we have to work. Now, we are talking about spoken English. We have limitations. It means we know only few constructions, only few patterns, only a few words. And with the help of these constructions and words, we will have to speak. We will have to do the practices. Whatever practice we do, within that limitations but if you confine yourself within that limitation within that circle then how can you grow you cannot grow ever so you'll have to learn every moment new words new constructions and speak them out so after doing these your limitations will be limited your limitations will be limited it means you will be enriched at present whatever knowledge you have work on that on the basis of that knowledge, speak out. Speak those words, speak those sentences. Those will be your practice. Now, with the help of these words and constructions, try to speak whatever you wish. And listen to English words and sentences. And listening them, make yourself enrich. Learn those sentences, learn those words. Remember one thing, if you try to mug up lots of words and sentences, those will not be helpful. Only memorizing words and sentences is not helpful. You have to use those words and sentences in your own speaking. When you will speak, when you will speak, you will have to use those words and sentences. On the other hand, within a shorter span of time, if you take an enormous task, it's not going to happen. You are not going to fulfill that task. We have our mental limitations too. If we wish within very few days, we will learn lots of sentences, lots of words, and we will be a very good speaker. It's not going to happen. The learning capacity of our brain is limited. It has a certain range. Very quickly, it's not possible to learn everything. It needs time. It needs a natural process. You have to go through that natural process. So respect your limitations. This is my real limitation. I know only few words, few sentences. At first, I'll have to be fluent on the basis of these words, on the basis of these sentences. And gradually, we will increase the words and sentences, the known words and sentences. And whenever we will learn a new sentence, whenever we will learn a few words, we will have to use them. We will have to use those words and sentences in our speaking, in our day-to-day -day life. Day-to-day -day life means we normally we don't speak in our day-to-day -day life, but as a learner of spoken English, we have to speak regularly. We have to speak regularly. If we speak regularly and using those newly learned words and sentences, we will be enriched. And when we will be enriched, it means your limitations are being reduced. You are, you are breaking the barriers. You are breaking the barriers. You are breaking the boundaries. You are making your boundaries large. It means you have now more space. Now, you have now more sentences and more words to speak. Now, you have the variety of words and sentences. You can speak in different manner. So, to be fluent, you must know lots of sentence pattern, lots of words. It's a very common fact that to be fluent, we must know lots of words and lots of sentences, lots of patterns, lots of constructions. But with the help of those words, sentences, sentence patterns, we have to speak. If we speak regularly, regularly means regularly. If we speak regularly, then only we will be fluent. All the sentences will come one after another. All the necessary words will come spontaneously. Spontaneous, this word is very important in case of being fluent. If you want to be fluent, the words and the sentences should come spontaneously without effort without even trying even before you try words and sentences will come out you won't have to think you won't have to think that i need these words i need these constructions again i'm coming to that point that at present we have limitations even after a few years you will have limitations but you will have more choices you will have lots of words lots of sentences at present you may have very limited words and sentences, but within very few months, within very few years, it will be possible for you to speak whatever you wish. 
as I have already spoken that we have restricted capacity of learning anything. Within a very short time, it's not possible that I will learn this much thick a book. We will learn a lot of things. It's not possible. We must engage enough time. We must do sufficient practice, investing a lot of practice. Only after that, you will be fluent. You are listening to my words and sentences. I don't know whether you understand me completely or not, but try to understand whatever I am telling you because all these words and sentences are very simple. These are arranged properly. And when you will be able to arrange sentences and words properly, you will be fluent. And you need this. It means you need practice. You must invest your time and energy. Then only it will be possible for you. And whether you are serious or not, whether you are serious or not, in case of learning spoken English, it matters too much. Because we need patience. Patience. Without patience, it's not possible. So, remember one thing, we have limitation, we have limited brain capacity within a very shorter period of time, we cannot learn spoken English. So, be respectful to the fact and keep practicing. I am not extending my words anymore. Love you all. Bye.